Cause I'm not just a pretty girl another video on my channel so today I will be doing a makeup collection video and if you cannot tell my voice is very raspy than usual and if you're new to my channel my voice doesn't really sound like this normally I'm just sick everybody gets sick and I guess I guess I'm just that person today so yeah um, today as I already said I'm going to be doing a makeup collection video and this is super highly requested that I show you guys all of my makeup and I'm super excited for this video I really hope you guys enjoy it if you don't I'm sorry that I let you down but um yeah let's get right into this video and I hope you guys enjoy here are the notification shadows for today's video and let's just get right into it and I really hope you guys enjoy I've said that line like 80 times so yeah let's get into it okay so we're gonna start off with the base of the face hey I rhymed um, so we're gonna start off with my face and I always start off with my concealer and the concealer I have is the new True Match Super Blendable Concealer and the a shade Cool. So it's drugstore. Most of my makeup is drugstore because I'm, I'm cheap and I can't afford like $20 concealer so yeah. Okay so yeah. Okay so I forgot this because usually this goes before um, concealer but we have my primer and I love this so much and it's just it's not really new anymore it says new master prime by face studio primer but it's not really new anymore because i got it like months ago so yeah and i got it at walgreens you know what honestly i'm not gonna go to order but i'm gonna i'm just gonna have all the face products so these are the concealers i don't really use anymore because one they're kind of like low like Literally nothing comes out of them anymore because I use them so much. But it's funny because this is my first liquid concealer. And like this is one that I got after it. It's like such different colors. Like like if you're just starting out makeup, don't expect yourself to find the perfect shade because I you, you won't. But the concealer I use now, which is the one I showed you earlier, does. It's, it's a really good shade for me. So yeah. Okay, so now we have my BB cream. And I do not use foundation because I don't really think I need pure foundation. I always say that all the time, but uh, yeah. We have the Fit Me Powder. We have this thing that I never use. We have what I use to do my eyebrows with this uh, lovely color. Lovely color right here. We have this contouring thing that's really cheap and I don't really use it because it's just not that good. So... We have this really adorable elf highlight. We have this vivid baked highlighter right here. And then we have what I use to blend. Oh my gosh, there's a hair on it. <sighs> so, yeah. And um, now we have this last thing for the face slash face. I love rhyming. And this is this Contour LA Colors kit. And I don't really use this much because this shade is way too light for me. This one's too dark for me. This one just doesn't work with my skin tone. So I don't really this much so we're gonna leave that aside so next we're moving on to eyeshadow just eyeshadow like that area you know so this is a recent one that I got and it's actually really good but it's not super pigmented which is kind of sucks but it's okay so and usually LA colors eyeshadows aren't really that good but this one is really good so this one is called the LA Colors 16 Eyeshadow Palette, and I'm obsessed with it. It doesn't really have a specific name. It's just LA Colors Eyeshadow Palette, and it looks like this. It is gorgeous, and I use many of these colors, but... So these two eyeshadows are my first eyeshadows that I ever got, ever. I never use these anymore, if you're wondering, like, never. So, um... Yeah, I don't wear blue eyeshadow, and I mean these are okay, but they're like way too like clumpy and stuff, so I don't wear those anymore. Okay, so then uh, this I showed it earlier before, but I didn't really show it that well. It has uh, the highlight. It has a highlighter in this or an eyeshadow. I don't know the difference. It kind of looks like a highlighter, but whatever. And it has an eyeshadow and another eyeshadow. Okay, so this eyeshadow palette, if you've been with my videos for forever. Then you have seen my third, fourth, fifth, and sixth grade makeup tutorial that is really cringy where I use this one. So, yeah. 
We have this one right here, and it is called the AU Natural Wet n Wild Eyeshadow Palette. And then this I got for my birthday from my best friend, and it is called the How to Make Nude Eyes Essence um, Makeup Box. So, yeah. Okay, so last but definitely not least, I got this for Christmas the, uh, in 2016. So, um, and this it has this, all these eyeshadows, like legit so many. And this one's like almost running out because I use it like way too much because like these, like guys, I literally, this thing's from Burlington and these eyeshadows are so good. They are so pigmented. These are the most pigmented eyeshadows I've ever seen. And you guys are like, probably like Kaylee, like usually these things, like these giant things don't really usually have like good eyeshadows and they're like cheap and just not good. But these, my gosh, these are so pigmented. Like I can't. And then um, this kind of went with the face, but I'm just kind of doing this whole thing. Well, we have this like blush area where I don't really wear blush at all. And then this contour one where I use this a lot for contour and this, so yeah. So that is it for eyeshadow. Next, we are going on to like eyeliner, mascara area of the makeup. You know what I mean? Okay, so we have the things I use for eyeliner, mascara, waterline, just that kind of area. Just anything like this black. Okay, so why am I holding this? So we have this, and I use this for my waterline a bunch, just the black color. It's meant for eyeshadow, but like, uh, I wouldn't use this for eyeshadow. So I use it for my waterline, but I've kind of recently stopped using it and started using my eyeliner more, which is kind of weird for me, but I don't know. So, so we have all the eyeliners that I own right here. And this one's kind of like for filling in like really big wings, and I love this one but I don't use it a lot because I don't usually do like really big winged but yeah so <laughs> yeah it's the covergirl intensify me eyeliner okay so then these are the exact same eyeliners they this is just older and I literally buy this eyeliner over and over I well I've only bought it twice but you know but I literally recommend this to the moon and back that made no sense um and it, this is the one I'm using now but this one like started running out so like I stopped using it. And then this is the one I use now. It's the same as that one. And it's the L'Oreal Paris, the Super Slim um, 12 hour inflatable, whatever thing. And it, it legit, when it says 12 hour, it means it. Like, no, I'm kidding. It lasts all day. So, um, yeah, these are all the eyeliners I have. And then for the mascara, I use the, okay, li literally, I've been using this thing for forever. It is the Fibers Mascara, the Super Fibers. I can't even. Read it. So the Super Sizer Fiber Cover Girl Mascara. Now we have lips, and I don't usually do my lips. I did try to do them today because of, you know, just felt some bougie up in here. So I actually did my lips today for this video. I just put on lip gloss, which is like that crazy. But um, we have my lip products right here, and I've gotten a lot of. I've gotten rid of so many lip products before because I just like they are just mm, like I've gotten rid of so many ugly horrifying gross lip products that like are so ugly colored and just horrible and I would never wear them again so yeah so first we have the basic EOS lip balm an LA colors lipstick that got horribly destroyed oh my god I think it's gonna fall out we're gonna let that, you know, be by itself. And we have this lip gloss that I, it's kind of like too pink, but it's like good, but it's too pink. Then we have what I'm wearing right now, which probably, I don't know what it did right now, I don't know how it looks, but it is the Glam and Beauty lip gloss, and this is what it looks like, and I have a few of these that are similar to it. I don't know what the other one was, it was like white type thing, I don't know. But I, used, I have three of these, but I don't know which one it is, so we're just going to go with that. Um, I never wear this one because it's way too pink, and I don't like way too pink. And then I'm wearing this one right now, so yeah, they're kind of like a kit. Oh, wait, here's the other one. Found it. Okay, so it looks like this. Then I have two elf, like, they're kind of... I don't really know how to describe them, but they're for your lips, so yeah.